Live from the news station, this is 7 News at 11. Might be up. I felt like there was a presence that, uh, you know, I felt like something wasn't right. This woman says she is still shaking tonight. This afternoon, deputies found a man hiding in her attic. And within just the past hour, we've learned the suspect's identity. Mike Banzoni talked with the homeowner's daughter in an interview you'll see only on 7. When Candy Ball stopped by this vacant house in Innery, her dad owns the other day, she felt uneasy. Well, I come down yesterday and I got a, um, a feeling of something wasn't right. Hours later, she called police after she says a family member told her this man, Thomas Zor, who's wanted in connection with a string of vehicle thefts, might be in the area with her son. I thought that he may be hanging around, that he might be around, but I had no idea he was in the attic. That's right. Investigators say they found Zora hiding in the home's attic. A viewer sent us this picture showing the moment deputies surrounded the house and arrested the man at gunpoint on the roof. It's very unsettling. It's very unsettling. You know, I'm, I'm still jerking inside. The owner's daughter says this wood board was covering that hole in the ceiling. She says that's the only way the suspect could have got inside the attic. Investigators say Zor is suspected of stealing a Coca-Cola van in Lawrence earlier this week. We could have got killed. We talked with eyewitness Rosa Yeldell on Wednesday. She told us she saw Zor run from Lawrence County deputies moments before she says he nearly ran her over. If I hadn't backed up a little bit, it probably would have hit me, knocked me out. I'm just glad nobody was leaving here at the time. Ball says even though Zor is in jail tonight, she still doesn't feel any better. I've been a nervous wreck. I'm still a nervous wreck ever. I'm just, I'm scared. In Spartanburg County, Mike Manzoni, 7 News. Zorro faces malicious injury to property charges. Deputies say he will head back to Lawrence County at some point to face more charges.